Uh, I'm Fritz Belko, I'm the project coordinator of what is called the TRP or the Training Resource Pack on Hazardous Waste Management. This is an old document and the purpose of this workshop is to bring new partners into the project and to update it to make it more relevant to the current needs of hazardous waste management around the world. In particular it's aimed at people who are giving lectures, proposals and training programs to give them support material and technical material to improve their communication. Well, this workshop has brought together uh, many of the partners and users and uh, interested organisations who have an interest in improving communication on hazardous waste management. So it includes people who have technical expertise who will help us revise the material and bring it up to date, but it also includes representatives of important user groups such as universities, uh, institutions, uh, waste associations and even individual companies that carry out training and education programs. So they've all agreed that the focus of the uh, training resource pack should be on helping people to prepare their own communication and training packages, uh, that it should en encompass quite significant technical material and linkages to other sources of technical material, but in particular that it should be user-based, user-oriented, and bring input in from the users on a continuing basis so that the TRP remains up to date. So it's going to be very much a user-driven project where the end users determine the content and the style and uh, the relevance of the material. So we're very pleased about that development to make it a, uh, a larger collaborative community uh, project rather than a single, uh, single point uh, project. We have a huge interest from all around the world. This workshop is particularly focused on the needs in Southeast Asia, so we have concentrated on the countries from the region. As I say, we have a very diverse group from 18 different countries here uh, who are bringing the perspective and expertise and, and experience from those countries into this so that the TRP will be relevant in the Southeast Asia region and then we will move to other regions in turn and in each region they will be able to adapt and modify the material to make it suitable for their use.